tutorial. Hi Mustangs, welcome back. This video will explain Homestead's tutorial expectations. In this module, you will learn about what is tutorial, when is tutorial, what do students do in tutorial, what do teachers do in tutorial, how is tutorial attendance recorded, what if you miss tutorial, and a little bit more. So what is tutorial? Tutorial is a time in the school schedule. Tutorial is a mandatory academic activity for all students. Students and teachers are in classrooms during tutorial. Students stay in the same class for the entire tutorial period. The key takeaway is that tutorial is an academic environment. This means that you should not be on Twitter or Instagram or any other platform. You should have your books open working on something academic. What about PE tutorial? Well, if you have a PE class, then you are eligible to attend PE tutorial. So PE tutorial is for PE students only. Students must wear their PE clothes Students must remain in the PE area until the end of tutorial. When is tutorial? So the great thing is that tutorial period is built into the school schedule. So you don't have to stay after school for tutorial or during lunch. Tutorial is held on Tuesdays, Wednesdays, and Fridays, and it is built into the schedule. What do students do in tutorial? Great question. During tutorial, students can meet with their teachers, complete homework, retake quizzes and tests, study with classmates, work on projects, or complete missing work or projects. Again, tutorial is an academic period. So students and teachers work together to make sure that you're working on something academic. Remember, teachers have the right to set which students are accepted into their tutorial period based on the subject, classroom space, students' punctuality, and student displayed participation. So if you show up 20 minutes late to a tutorial classroom, you may not be let in because you weren't there on time. Or if you go to a tutorial class and you're goofing around. That teacher may not allow you to come back to their classroom for the next tutorial. So make sure that you take tutorial period seriously. What do teachers do during tutorial? Well, they provide academic support, set in-class expectations, monitor student attendance. Teachers, you can pause this video at this point and you can select some student volunteers if you wish for them to read some of the other examples out loud in class. How is tutorial attendance recorded? You need to make sure to check in with the teacher and scan this QR code. The QR code will record the time that you arrive to the class. You will enter your name, your student ID, and this will be monitored by your guidance counselors, the administrators, your AVID coordinators, coaches. All teachers will have access to this roster so that we can keep track of where you are attending for tutorial. So you must be in class to be able to scan this QR code. Teachers do not allow kids to take pictures of the QR code. Uh, we will be using this attendance also to follow up with parents if we have students that are missing out on tutorial. Now you may have some questions. Well, what do the admin do during tutorial? Well, we walk around and monitor the campus. And if you happen to be lost, we will walk you to your class for tutorial. But once the bell rings, all students should be in a classroom. But what if you don't have anything to work on? Trust me, there's always something to work on. Tutorial is a perfect time to get ahead in your reading, to study, 
or to start future projects. And if you need help identifying something that you can work on, um, surely a guidance counselor, a dean, an administrator, or your teachers can help you plan. But what if you have an open period before tutorial? Well, tutorial is a mandatory period, so you need to arrive to school. You must be here. Make sure that you show up and that you don't have to make up tutorial on a Saturday or in the morning during detention. Now I read through these really fast, so you may want to go back and look over the previous slides. They are also available on our school website and this presentation will be shared with your parents also so that they review it. Enter any questions in our Google form and we will be live answering your questions that your students may have. This is a great time for teachers to respond to questions that kids may have about how you will carry out tutorial. So feel free to use the rest of the time to answer any questions that kids may have.